Turkish Aerospace showcased the anti-submarine warfare capabilities of its Axengor medium-altitude long-endurance, male, unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, at Navdex 2023, which takes place in Abu Dhabi from February 20 to 24, 2023. Turkish Aerospace exhibited the Axengor male UAV fitted with various types of payloads including the Sonobui pod for anti-submarine warfare, ASW. The pod on the drone was a model of the Sonobui system which is currently under development. Axengor is a high-capability drone developed by Turkey's defense industry and currently used by the Turkish Armed Forces. Since October 2021, the Turkish Navy has been operating Axengor. Its long endurance in the air, which exceeds 60 hours, makes it useful not only for ISR missions but also for anti-submarine warfare. Turkish Aerospace has been working on outfitting Axengor with a Sonobui monitoring and launching system for about two years in order to increase Axengor's efficiency in ASW. The project is divided into three phases. Axengor is expected to gain Sonobui monitoring capability in the first phase, which means it will be able to collect data from Sonobuis and relay it to the control station without processing. The second phase involves processing the data collected from the Sonobuis. In the third phase, it will be able to launch a real Sonobui, monitor and process the data, and relay it to the other naval units. The most surprising development about Axengor is the addition of a torpedo to the drone. Turkish Aerospace is working on mounting a very light torpedo on the drone. Turkish Aerospace officials claim that after fitting Sonobuis and torpedoes to Axengor, it will be able to conduct maritime patrol aircraft efficiently. The officials didn't reveal details about the project but claimed that they are exercising the options for the details of the new capability. Derived from TAI's combat-proven Anka UAV, Axengor is a medium-altitude long-endurance, male, class UAV system, capable of performing day and night intelligence, surveillance and reconnaissance, ISR, and strike missions with EO, IR, SAR and SIGINT payloads, and a variety of air-to-ground weapons. Anka Axengor is powered by two PD-170 twin turbocharged diesel engines enabling long-endurance operations up to 40,000 feet. Thanks to the know-how gained from Anka, Thai developed the Axengor in 18 months. It made its maiden flight in 2019 and has reached 1,000 flight hours since then. During trials, it carried out the live firing at 20,000 feet altitude and hit the naval target successfully with a KGK SIA-82 guided munition at a range of 30 kilometers in the Black Sea on the 25th of April. Axengor has three hardpoints on each wing with 500 kilograms, 300 kilograms and 150 kilograms capacities. Teber 81 and 82 guidance kits for laser-guided MK-81 and 82 bombs. MAM-L, 16 km, and MAM-C, 30 km, smart munitions. L UMTAS laser-guided missile. Sirit laser-guided missile. KGK-82 wing-assisted guidance kit. Small diameter bombs.